guys hey guys good morning I'm currently on my way to get my hair done so I'll be getting the second session of the mesotherapy and the red light therapy if you guys aren't aware I'm struggling with CCA and a P shot so I've been trying to do different things over the year and this is where I'm at so I did do a video the last time documenting the journey starting to document the journey and explain what the procedure is like so if you guys didn't watch that one and you are interested then go ahead and watch the previous video explaining all of that but yeah my appointment is at 12 it's now 10 39 to be honest I don't know what I've been doing for morning I got up from like 8 8 10 thereabouts and I don't know the spirit of cleaning came over me I washed out the bathroom a shower the face base uh, like they're cleaning the bathroom and time just went by so yeah I'm currently on my way to get that done I had to call Vicky to come and pick me up because he brought Donnick to a swimming class so yeah going to the train station now so fingers crossed Mama, are we going to the train station? you're going to drop mommy off at the train station Yay. yeah and then you are going to get a trim Oh yeah. Yeah, you say we're both getting our hair done today, Don Rick. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah guys, I'll speak to you guys when I'm in the city. Yeah, so speak to you then. Alright guys, there's been a slight change in the past because as soon as I got to London Bridge, the stylist messaged me to say like oh she's running a bit behind so I should try and come by 12.30 instead. So to kill time I'm going to go to Token Studios because I went there last year with Ramona. I think I did that IG reel showing you guys that. So yeah, I went there and I paid the £10 for them to cure the pottery that I did. But typical me, I didn't go and collect it. So to kill the time, as I said, I'm going to head there now and see if they still have it. If I can just collect it and then make my way back. So London Bridge train station so I can pick it up so yeah fingers crossed we can get it all right guys thanks so that was a complete waste of time because apparently they only keep the pottery items for maximum of six months and mine has been disposed of anyways regardless I've made it to the salon now, so I'm just going to grab something to eat and then make my way over to them. Watch the 
Good morning, good morning, guys. To be honest, things aren't turning out like oh, I really wanted it to. Cause at first I was thinking like oh, before I leave the house, I wanted to like do a wig installation for you guys. But I don't know what I did with my little glass. Like I know I used it last week, and since then I don't know where I put it. So I'd have to get a new one. Cause. I really wanted to do the big installation in this video because I got a Yaki Yaki 5x5 closure wig. I did try and bleach the knots yesterday. So I did the prep work thinking like oh everything is good to go but as usual something had to happen to like just throw me off course but anyways at the moment I'm on my way to try and get my eyebrows sorted this is a very much like last minute decision because before i was going to just go to the regular lady i used to go to get them treaded but i don't know i kind of messed up the other day and i took my enough self and used a nair to kind of like shape them up and like since then i don't feel like i don't feel like they've come back properly they're like very much non-existent at the moment like they're not growing back so uh, i booked for a bro lamination bro lamination 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 bro lamination and 
tinting but then she messaged me last night and said like oh by right I should have gotten like a patch test 48 hours before but she's going to try and see what we can do if I don't do the brow lamination and tinting then I just might do a uh, brow wax and the tinting because like I need some kind of like definition some kind of shaping for them so I'm on my way to get that done now after that I have a appointment to do a pedicure at one o'clock so yeah I'm on track to getting both of them done on time so fingers crossed it works out and then I can go and get a mirror a mirror <laughs> so we can do the wig installation later on because I had no intention of wearing back this wig anytime soon but you know like I was running for time so I just had to like slap it on but anyways see you guys in a bit I feel like your skin's already taken to this quite quickly so I'm gonna take off soon when we take off the tint the tint will still go later on today mm -hmm. but it will come off your skin because it's mainly on your skin then it will be on your head okay. yeah. Just here. You want to add more? Uh, um, not add more. Take like, off. yeah, just yeah, the lining in it. Seems a bit slightly off. Sorry, I'm taking off your makeup as well. Thanks. Okay. No, yeah, this is They're going to take a bit longer. This, you know, when you get the tips, see, like here. Yeah. When we're washing our face, that's going to go a bit more quicker than the one that actually has the hair on it. Mm -hmm. But it will, you know. Sorry, I'm taking all your makeup off. No, no, it's alright. It's <laughs> just a bit of tinting. So, yeah, you'd push them all into place, get them up to wherever you want to have them, and then you can either create a line mm. or some like one lady wanted them literally just up. Yeah. You know? No, I think I'd prefer the, the line. Straight, you know, so it's all fresh. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Sorry. Can I have the cappuccino? Cappuccino, yes. Um, do you have oat milk? We've got oat milk. Yes. If you want any syrup, we've got caramel and vanilla. I'll take the vanilla. Vanilla. Okay, thanks. Thank you. Thanks. So 
sorry I haven't spoken to you guys since I left the nail salon. If you hear a noise in the background, that's Ricky. He's trying to like do the flooring as well. Like we're trying to change out the flooring, but be cost effective about it. So yeah, he's in the background trying to do that. Kind of ignores like I have to do what I have to do. So yeah, as I was saying to you guys earlier, I got a wig and I wanted to do the installation with you guys. So this is the wig I got. I got it from YG and it was a Yaki, I think it's 16 inch. If it's not, I'll put it in the description box or on the screen for you guys. And you guys know I love a closure. So this is a five by five closure. I did go ahead and try and bleach the knots. To be honest, that's not my like expertise like i'm just i'm just trying something and to be honest it's all right like it could have been better but i was getting a bit nervous because i feel like it was coming on today here so yeah that's that but i'm pleasantly surprised by it because usually um yaki here i feel like it has a more synthetic vibe to it like it's just always tangling and stuff like that but this one is a pretty soft no tangling so far i did wash it as you would after bleaching it so yeah i did wash it shampoo condition all of that and then just let it hair dry and look soft 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 i'm surprised so yeah as you can see the brush is just going through it no hesitation and yeah there's nothing in the brush so yeah let's just go ahead and try and install this it did came with like four combs as you can see and then i really like that it has the adjustable band elastic band there as well so this is very ideal if you don't want to like glue down the wig and you know the band will just help to keep it secure so let me just go ahead and show you guys what i'm working with as you can see from the previous clips i did go and get a second treatment of the mesotherapy and since then i've just been wearing my hair in like these little cornrows that's one of the things i really want to work on for this year because i can't care anymore to like save my life but i feel like this can work with this can work here. Yeah. As you guys know, my hair is very fine, so they don't really look like much, but at least there's some length. <laughs> Try and put this one on and then I'll put on the wig and then see what we're working with from there. There. So, yeah. Okay. It's not looking bad. I think I'm going to try and stick with a middle part and low-key i want to try and see if i can cut some layers i'm not sure if i'm brave enough to do that but we'll try we'll try so fun fact i don't have a hot comb this is what i use to kind of like smooth out my wig so i don't know it's been working for me so i don't really see the need to go out and buy a hot comb if something's not broken like why fix it but yeah, this is what the lace is looking like at the moment. If you guys see me looking this direction, it's just because I got the mirror now. Remember earlier I was saying to you guys like, oh, the mirror, I can't find it. Mr. Brown was listening to me and when I left the nail salon, I was saying to him like, oh, I'm just going to pop in pound nine and see if I can get a mirror. He's like, don't worry, I got one for you, so come through mr brown trying to help me out actually listening yeah so yeah i was pretty happy about that so what i'm going to do now is i think this is going to be my parting this seems pretty straight and then just to control the fly away just go in with my wax stick you might more than like girl you're not going to cut the lace but I just feel like I'm able to style it a bit better while the lace is on it and then once I kind of like style it and decide like yeah this is it now I just go ahead and cut the lace after I don't know if you guys can tell but I can already see the bits 
where the bleach was kind of seeping through well I guess that's kind of promising then at least you know if you wanted to bleach this wig it would take it pretty good you wouldn't have to worry about that my goodness the ear just soft like the comb is just running through it like no hesitation whatsoever and I think I paid like 100 and a little bit okay guys can you tell the difference already this is a bit that I was using the curling wand on and you can see like it flattened a bit so I'm just going to keep on doing that until it reaches it gives the look that I'm trying to go for I'm not even going to take credit for this a friend of mine the one that I used to buy the wigs from so the very first couple of weeks that you would have seen me in on the channel, I got it from her. And she's the one that said like, oh, I don't know, I'll just take the curling one and flatten the wig. So yeah, since then, I haven't looked back. I'm not going to like every now and then. I'm a bit tempted. I'm like, oh, I wonder if I should like just indulge and actually get a hot comb. But I keep looking at them on Amazon. all intentions of like gluing the wig down but it doesn't need to be glued down it's okay this is good this is good and I the lace I feel like I could pluck it a bit more to be honest it does feel a bit dense at the front but I don't know because I feel like if I wear it as a middle part, the density is okay. It's just like for a side part, it would need you know, a little tweaking. But this isn't bad. Let me just try and see if I can do like two little swoop. Even though I'm the absolute worst for baby years. Years, <laughs> baby hair. Scissors down the hill. What do you guys think? Like, should I stick to the side part or should I go for a middle part? I don't know. I don't know what to do. <laughs> Man, this behind here is like them have me in a chokehold. Like, we're married and we can't get a divorce. Like, I don't know. I'm addicted, stuck with it, can't move on. We could do a little deep curve. But I actually like this. I feel like it's giving a very natural look. And 
I don't really need to do much for the layers. I'm actually surprised. I didn't have high expectations for the wig, but come through. And then what I like to do as well is to just take up my little side here and then you know let it look like then my blend in together <laughs> okay you can't talk to me no you can't tell me that this isn't my hair you can't tell me that this isn't my hair I just went and got like a Brazilian blowout or a silk press no this is nice this is nice because I really wanted a break from the bobs but I don't know I feel like the bobs were like yeah everyone knows it's a wig but it was a bit more natural looking so this is still giving put together it's still giving you know reserved but she still look cute yeah she can't put herself together Ooh. <laughs> okay all right guys talk to me nice talk to me nice girl feel cute girl feel cute who is this like hi can I help you not with my dry lips but that needs to be started um all right guys so this is the final look hope you guys enjoyed this video i know it was like pretty straightforward i didn't do anything crazy but at the same time like i think it just shows to you guys that like wig installation can be pretty straightforward it doesn't have to be anything crazy about like lean edges not laying edges, laying, yeah, laying edges, doing baby hair and all of that. So, as you can see, like, I'm not the biggest fan of the baby hair movement. I just feel like it just shows that you're trying to hide the lace. I might do a little one swoop. So, like, if I wanted to, I might do a little one swoop, take out another one here, do another little one swoop there. But, yeah. I don't think it's like really needed so won't be doing that for this week at least for now but yeah really loving the hair at first i was thinking like i'm going to wear this to work but now now this is my going out here now it's cute enough <laughs> it's cute enough to be a staple so thank you guys so much for watching i know like a lot of the stuff that i wanted to do in this video i didn't really get to do i had to cancel my appointment because like girl was sick all of last week but i am still going to try and push through so i think we'll be doing a bit more of these videos because that's my thing for 2023 I'm taking care of me. I'm trying new stuff. I'm spending on myself instead of like always wanting to like oh save save save. I'll spend money on clothes, clothes on my belly. That's the only thing I really spend money on. But for 2023, I really want to you know change things up a bit, pamper myself every now and then. So we see how we get on with that but as i said earlier like the did i say it the details to this wig will be in the description box if you guys are interested it is from Y wig um i also wanted to do my nails but i'm not really sure because i was kind of iffy the salon i went to today because i was trying to go somewhere different where that has a nice little ambience and stuff like that but they don't do acrylic they're only doing natural nails and i kind of bit my nails so like they're down to nothing i feel like if i'm working and i'm trying to like process something in my head the easiest thing for me to do is just like 
start writing my nails and I was trying to save them so I could do them but anyways I did get this package not get I bought this from Amazon the other day I've used it once so far but to be honest nail polishing isn't my expertise you know let me just show you guys given that we are on here now so, oh it's just a gel nail set and it comes with all the different colors and then you can get matte they have the matte look or if you want the normal shine effect you can get that as well the colors are pretty good so they have different shades of pink green they have the white all your neutrals and stuff like that so the quality of the polish is really good I'm not complaining about that it's just my technique i need to work on that i've done it once so far probably some other time we can do a little relaxing self-care that would be a vibe self-care video do a little facial and stuff like that that would be a vibe so we might do that another time drink a little wine catch up on our shows how about this girls girls night would that be a thing <laughs> I don't know. But anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And as usual, don't forget to go ahead, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. So bye for now. Bye.